Yo, what's up? Today I'll be showing you how I gained 47,000 followers on Instagram in only 30 days. I've been battling with the algorithm for a long time now and I finally found what works for me. So here's what we're going to be covering today. We're going to be covering all of the big pictures, the repurposed strategy on how I turn my other content into Instagram posts, the PAS method, how I design posts really fast and finally how to leverage your network to expand your reach. So let's get started by going to Social Blade. Let's do that right now. Here, Social Blade. Let's check it out. At the moment, according to Social Blade, I have 74,000 followers, but it's actually 75,000 followers. So this is a little bit behind in regards to the stats. Nevertheless, check this out. Let's zoom in. And as you can see on the 30th of June, I gained 1700 followers. And I'll be showing you exactly what I posted there to make sure that you understand what happened. A few days later, I started gaining five, six, three, one, 5,000, 10,000, 7,000 followers by just following the steps that I'm going to be giving you. So let's go to Instagram and let's check this out. Bam, Instagram, let's zoom in. And as you can see, I now have 75,000 followers and I believe you can see what I'm trying to do on Instagram. And it's basically repurposing my tweets. And let me talk a little bit more about that. So now that we're done with the big picture, let's talk about the repurpose strategy that I use. And let's go to that right now. For that, I'm going to go to my presentation and check this out. What I actually do is the following thing. So this is the repurpose strategy. And what I do is I find my best performing tweets and I turn them into carousels with one condition that all of these tweets are about one theme. Let's say I choose the topic of money. I grab a bunch of tweets, best performing tweets, and I turn them into carousels. And after that, I just use Figma, the design app, to turn the tweets into real screenshots, right? Into real pictures that finally I upload to Instagram in the form of carousels with a really nice caption. So let's go back to Instagram and let me show you exactly the tweet that started this boom for me. Let's scroll down and let's find the tweet that did this for me. And it's this one. It's all about business, as you can see. One, the first post is about just build the business, right? And do it against all odds. The second post of the carousel, it's more motivational content about starting the business. And as you can see, it's all business, 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 and of course, business. And finally, the caption is all about the business. That said, why do I think these posts are getting so much attention? I mean, 5,000 likes, 2,000 likes, 700 likes, and look at this one, 43,000 likes, and finally, 82,000 likes. What is happening? Let's go back to our beautiful presentation to show you exactly what's happening. Let's talk about the PAS method. This is a copywriting hack that it's just so powerful when you know how to use it. And PAS stands for problem, agitation, and solution. And let me show you exactly how I use this method or framework to create captivating tweets that eventually become carousels for Instagram. So now we're back on Instagram and check this. Out. Let's find the tweet that started actually gaining me a bunch of followers, which was this one that almost has 80,000 likes. And if you take a look at the insights, it's incredible. Over a million, oh wow, wow. Almost a quarter of 10 million, bro, that's a lot. So check this out, 26,000 followers just from this single post. But why is it working so well? Now, let me tell you, I was not expecting this to blow up like this, but here's the formula to actually gain attention using the PAS method. And it goes like this. You describe a problem, modern life is killing you. Then you agitate that problem. And as you can see, I'm agitating here. Everything is sugar, everything is polarized, everything is sexualized, everything has to be delivered yesterday. These are things that are relatable, right? We're sick of all of this stuff. Finally, the solution, rebel against this. Start by enjoying the small things. And of course, I also use a little bit of that over here, right? I'm agitating a little bit more what people do. And finally, the solution to all of these things. But let me show you another example that uses the same formula so you can see it in different ways. This one, again, problem. You're young, 
Time goes really fast. Agitate. Blink once and you'll have 40 years and then 60 years and you'll still be locked in a cubicle. Use your youth to get ahead. That's the solution. And finally, one of the posts that has gained me the most amount of email subscribers. This one right here. But why? Let me tell you why. First, there's a big typo here. You will never be ready, but that's not why. Let me tell you why. It's because I'm using the pay as method once again, but instead of using it in the first image of the carousel, I'm actually using it right here. And let me show you how that looks. Problem, procrastination is killing you. Your goals are insufficient. I'm agitating right here. I'm agitating much more so you can agitate and double down on the agitation. Finally, I go to the solution. The solution is the seven pillars. And it's a guide that I created to show people how to become more productive as entrepreneurs or solo entrepreneurs or freelancers or coaches or consultants, people who use knowledge to further their lives, right? So after that solution, what I do is I encourage people to join my newsletter. Then after I tell people, hey, here's your alternative, here's your solution, I give them a call to action. DM me the word pillar to get a free copy of the seven pillars guide. And anyone that DMs me the word pillar on Instagram will get a link from me automated because I use an app called ManyChat to automate that because dude, I've gotten like 3000 DMs in the last seven days. All of these asking for that guide and another guide that I have for you in a while. Anyhow, again, I'm just using the problem. You can see it here, the agitation and the solution. And I finalize that with a call to action. Beautiful, right? So now what's the next step? It's now about time to talk about how I design these posts. And let me show you how to do that right now. Let's go back to our beautiful screen and let's go to Figma, which is an app that I use to design my stuff. And as you can see, I already have a template for that. And what I do is I go to Twitter. Let's open Twitter. Boom. Then I go to the search box. Let me zoom out. Let me find a search box. It should be right here. There it is. Then I add this query that you see here, the keyword from this account that has at least a hundred likes. As you can see, all of these tweets have a hundred likes. And what I do is I just copy paste me or my designer, go back to Figma and paste that right there. And now I have a tweet that talks about sales. I could do the same thing right here. I could scroll down and copy all of that and paste it right here. And I could just paste it right here or whatever, right? Boom, there it is. Let's delete all of that. And now I have a different tweet. Let's remove all of that. And then I export all of these images into a post. And that's basically how I do it. It's really straightforward. Find the best performing tweets and just use those as a way to gain attention on Instagram. And finally, how to leverage your network. Boom, there it is. And it's really straightforward. Let's go back to Instagram. And now that we are here, check this out. Let's go to see my stories and let's scroll through my stories to check what am I doing. So look at this simple thing. Look at that. I'm just sharing my friends posts on my stories and they are doing the same thing for me. And the thing is that I knew all of these people from Twitter. So what I'm doing is leveraging my friends, my connections, my other social medias to drive traffic to my Instagram account. Owen shares my stuff all the time. I'm also sharing his stuff. Who else? Let me see. I think there's another, a few side hustle Bible. He's sharing my stuff and I share his stuff too. Let's see. Ed Lattimore also shares my stuff and I share his stuff. And all of these guys I met from Twitter. So if you have friends from other social media platforms, feel free, feel super free to tell them, Hey, I will love, I will love for you to help me out on Instagram and I'll help you out too. So that's all there is to it. That's all there is to it. You don't need nothing else. You leverage your network, you repurpose your tweets or your other content from other social media platforms. You turn that into Instagram posts, you post that and you tell your friends, Hey, help me out and I'll help you out too. This is the formula to gain a bunch of followers. Now, I can't promise you that you'll gain 40 something thousand followers in a month, but I can promise you that if you do this long enough, you'll be able to grow not only Instagram, you can use the same methods that I just told you to grow Twitter, LinkedIn, also TikTok, and any other social media platform that you are 
trying to grow, specifically if you use the PAS method, which is one of the best, simplest copywriting tools that you can ever use. And by the way, if you would like to get one of my free guides about productivity or about how to create ebooks, you can find them down below in the description box. That's all I have for you. My name is Jose Rosado, and thank you so much for joining me in this new video. Hopefully you like the new format. I'm just trying it out to see how, how it works. I have a new camera here and another one here, which is just my iPhone that I found a way just to connect it to my, to my computer. So I'm really glad on, on how it looks and feel free to ask me any questions down in the comments. Talk to you soon and see you in the next video.